Hi friends. Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to resolve a common startup error in VMware Workstation. Let's dive right in. I'm going to demonstrate this issue using my virtual machine Win ADHD. First, I'll try to power it on by clicking power on this virtual machine. But instead of starting, a pop-up appears with the message. Virtualized Intel VTX EPT is not supported on this platform. Continue without Virtualized Intel VTX EPT. If I click yes, another error appears. VMware Workstation does not support nested virtualization on this host. Module HV Power on failed. Failed to start the virtual machine. Clicking OK brings us back to the same point. And if I try to power it on again but select no, it still shows, failed to start the virtual machine. Let's solve this issue step by step. First, click on, edit virtual machine settings. Navigate to processes. On the right side, under the virtualization engine section, check if, virtualized Intel VTX, EPT or AMD V, RVI, is selected. In my case, it is selected, but it's grayed out, meaning I can't edit it directly. To fix this, switch to the Options tab in the Virtual Machine Settings. Click on Advance. Here, you'll see the option, Enable VBS, Virtualization Based Security, Support. Notice that this option is checked. Uncheck it. Go back to the Hardware section, and now you'll be able to uncheck, Virtualized Intel VTX, EPT or AMD V, RVI. Click OK to save the changes. Now, let's power on the virtual machine again. And there you have it. The virtual machine powers on smoothly, with no errors popping up. I hope this tutorial was helpful and solved your issue. If you liked the video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel for more videos. Thank you for watching, and see you in the next video. Bye.